bringing back the piccolo, the piccolo snare drum, because I feel like there's a little void out there right now with piccolos. And hey, this is a classic sound. This is a classic drum that shouldn't be forgotten about, because including myself, I've gone to the deep snares and, and followed that train. And sometimes we forget there's a lot of depth that you can get from, from a shallow shell. And how this whole piccolo thing came about as far as being a part of my sound is, in the studio, uh, we used the piccolo snare drum on a few songs. And it turned out to be one of those things that was that new jack type of sound that we wanted to play instruments that represented that time. So we're talking about 90s music here. So when it came time to think about the right drums for the tour, and if you know me, if you've seen some of my interviews before, you know that I always think about the right sound and using the right tools. And in this case, DW built me a 4x13 snare drum for the tour so I could duplicate the one we used in the studio. And that thing has been amazing. We have a 6x6 European maple shell. So that's six plies with a six ply reinforcement hoop. If you don't know, PDP does not make any snare drums or maybe even drum shells with reinforcement hoops. So this is a first for them, which is pretty exciting. Also, this is gonna be the first drum that PDP carries that has gold hardware, which I think, if you know me and you've seen my kits and you've seen that it's, I use a lot of gold hardware and it wouldn't be right for me to put out some type of signature drum that doesn't have the black and gold look. It's kind of become a thing. You know, a lot of working drummers are downsizing their gear. This is another good tool for their arsenal, you know. If you picked up another one of those small compact kits, well, here's a nice compact snare that you can have a wide tuning range. Boom, you got a tight snare, you got a fat snare. It's all here. This can be your ballad snare. This can be your primary snare. You can make it sound like a popcorn snare. You got a wide range here. So I think it's a beautiful thing, and I'm extremely, extremely grateful for DW giving me this opportunity. And uh, I hope to hear you playing this soon. <laughs>